In the name of Almighty God, the United States of America and the United Mexican States, animated by a sincere desire to put an end to the calamities of the war which unhappily exists between the two republics and to establish upon a solid basis relations of peace and friendship which shall confer reciprocal benefits upon the citizens of both and assure the concord harmony and mutual confidence within the two people should live as good neighbors have for that purpose appointed their respective plenipotentiaries. that is to say the president of the united states has appointed nicholas p trust a citizen of the united states and the president of the mexican republic has appointed don luis gonzaga cuevas don bernardo cuoto and don miguel artiston citizens of the said republic who after a call communication of the respective full powers have under the protection of almighty god the author of peace arranged agreed upon and signed the following treaty of peace friendship limits and settlement between the united states of america and the mexican republic the united states and mexico on february 2 1848 signed the treaty of guadalupe hidalgo that ended the war between both countries this treaty established how much land america was going to take from mexico and where the border for texas stood the words used in the treaty were all lies they talked about establishing peace and friendship between both countries that did not exist even after the treaty was created the united states had a strong amount of racism and xenophobia toward mexicans in america although they were neighboring countries they didn't treat each other as such the treaty of guadalupe hidalgo was unfair to mexico as america took a lot of land this land would later bring fortune to the united states during the gold rush in california in 1849 showing the true unfairness of the treaty